Well, if we consider that they're cross-functional, data quality is sometimes unknown, which is the major input we have and is sometimes not always under our control. And then that users sometimes don't understand what they want and the KPIs they're defining may not be clearly aligned to the data that we've got to use. There are quite a lot of issues we have to overcome. Uh, why companies find it quite challenges, challenging is that they often have quite long delivery cycles from their IT departments. So for example, if you're using a waterfall approach where you have to define the requirements up front, get them approved, and then go into, let's say, a six-month delivery cycle, quite often by the time you've delivered, what you're delivering isn't what the end user requires anymore because business has moved on. So to implement business intelligence solutions, we strongly recommend you take a more agile development approach whereby you short delivery cycles, iterative delivery cycles, qualify with the end users continuously what they want, what their priorities are. As you stumble with a difficulty, don't dwell on it, move on, park it, document it, try and overcome it. If you can't over overcome, it, overcome it, move on to the next stage of the delivery. Keep the momentum going, keep the deliveries going into the business, let them change their mind. Big difference there. We don't need them to stamp in blood on the paper and sign it, this is what we're going to get, and then deliver that. Let them change their mind, bring the business into the project team.